All right, so today I'm gonna to tell you some things you can get from Cydia. The first thing that probably comes to your mind is the black screen that I got. It's dynamic and you can actually put this onto your home screen, but it's just gonna drain way too much battery. The life, uh, the app for it is called V Wallpapers right here. It's completely free from Cydia. It also comes with the, the cursor, which you can see from my other finger, the, the whatever you wanna call it, the shadow. Uh, and this will also drain some battery, but again, it's well worth it. All right, so I had to get rid of the finger cursor because it was a bit in the way of the video. But the next app, the next tweak is called Barrel. Uh, it's a classic when it comes to jailbreaking, and it basically makes your apps uh, animate whenever you swipe through the screens, just like this. If I go to settings, there it offers a few animations which you can easily choose from without even having to respring your device. So let's just choose uh, Icon Scatter for example and we will have a different animation. And I think this is a must have whenever you jailbreak because it really separates your phone from others. All right, so the next tweet that you can get from Cydia is called Iconizer. It basically makes your whole screen go crazy and every single app uh, animates itself. It's a cool way to uh, pull a prank on your friends or whatever. Just It's useless, but it's pretty cool in my opinion. So uh, this is the tweak over here. And if you have it enabled, you are you don't have to put the animations. You can also put a background glow to the app. So for example, uh, if I choose glow color to to system green, you see the app is green in the background. And if I take the animation, uh, if I take these spinning animation, they will just be stable with a green background glowing color, which is amazing. Get this at your own risk. It's probably gonna make your battery die quicker, but it's a pretty cool way to stand out. All right, the next tweak we got is the little logo on the top left corner. It's another classic when it comes to jailbreaking and it's called Zeppelin. Here you can have many little themes coming up on the top left and this is completely harmless and very simple and I think this having just this one little logo on this corner is literally one of the best tweaks that you can get because it's, it's just so, it looks so neat. The next app, the next tweak that we got from Cydia is called AppCake. This is a a new app store basically which will allow you to get any single app for free you know, using hacked websites so for example let's search up Grand Theft Auto and as you know it's around seven dollars on the app store but here is gonna be here you got every single GTA and they're absolutely free I'm not going to download it for the sake of the video. Now the next tweak is actually kind of useful finally. It's called Xmod Games. <clears throat> and with the help of this app, you can get some modded games on your phone if you're a fan. So it offers a limited amount of games. Unfortunately, there's only about maybe 20. These, these are literally all the games, but they're quality games. For example, this 8-Ball Pool Mod or Clash of Clans, definitely worth the download. The next feature that Cydia offers is called Local App Store. What this feature does is it generates custom receipts on your apps that you download, which allows you to purchase anything within a game completely for free. So for example, Let's go to this game over here. Okay, so let's visit the shop real quick. And this works in many games, not just this one. So let's buy $20 worth of their in-game currency. As soon as the touch ID comes up or enter your passcode, you just click cancel. And voila, you get the coins. Unfortunately, as years go by, more developers are placing 
custom receipt bans, so you will not be able to purchase in-game currency in many games nowadays, but those which you can do it is well worth it. So go ahead and get this tweak. The next tweak is called Flex. This is probably the best, the most useful tweak that you can get, and it will allow you to get custom scripts for many apps. So for example, I, don't, I only have a limited amount here, but you can literally get any single game and install some sort of mod on it. For example, Instagram follower hacks, uh, YouTube, uh, anti-ad, uh, Snapchat followers, uh, anything that you can think of, Flex3 will probably have it. But unfortunately, it only gives you two downloads a day, so be careful of what you really want and what you can wait for. The final app that I'm going to show you is also extremely useful. I apologize if the screen is a bit too bright. But anyways, this app is called PlayTube. This app allows you to catch YouTube songs for free. So what it is, is literally it's YouTube, but it allows you to save songs. So as you can see, if I go to my playlists, I have all these songs completely cached on my phone. Not a dime was paid for them, and I never have to use my LTE to listen. Very useful. Again, the app is called PlayTube. But I hope this video was helpful. Hopefully I gave you some ideas on what you can get from jailbreaking your phone. I would definitely encourage you to go ahead and just do the jailbreak. It's not going to harm you in any way. You can always get rid of the jailbreak if you don't like it. Please leave feedback in the comments. Leave a like or a dislike. Anything is appreciated. Uh, but thank you and have a nice day.